we're going to be, this is Soulless. Today we'll be playing Demon Souls, I've never played it before, and then I haven't played any of the Dark Souls games or anything like that. So let's see how it goes. I've heard they're really fun, but definitely a rage game. Alright, so on the first day, let's see what happens on this first day. Man. How's it hanging, bro? Here. Right, new game, loading into Demon Souls. Alright, let's be body type A. Lots of female, okay. Right, let's see what we've got for character types. Now, I did, I have played Diablo, and I found in Diablo I really like people with magic, so, uh, they also I also like people who are a bit more versatile, so let's see. Alright, so Magician has magic, uh, the Knight Templar has, you know, some, some, I think some type of magic too. Then, Royalty has magic, which is kind of nice. Uh, does anyone else do? No. Alright. No, I am royalty. No. So let's go with that one. Alright, and then... Ooh, I like that. Uh, what is foundation? Oh, it's like it's voice. Let's go with B. Let's go with that one. I like that. Okay, appearance. Uh, let's see, what we've got. Well, since we are playing Demon Souls, I think I'm gonna try to go for a more demon y face. Wait, I can give a woman a man's face. This game's amazing. Ooh, I like that. Let's go to skin. I'm gonna make it a bit more darker. 
tints is like that, yeah, that bluish tinge to it. Oh no, I did not mean to do that, god damn it. Eyebrows. Yeah, I don't really like his hair. Let's go ahead and just do that real fast. Let's see what we can do. Oh, that's nice. That makes him look fucking ugly, dude. Let's see what else we got. And um, we're back at the beginning. I think we'll go with that one, you know? This is like nice and neat. Now you definitely need some facial hair. We like that with that, and then we need some mustache. That works with it. Change the color up. And we're gonna give him like that snowy. Oh, damn it! Oh, the tattoos. I'm trying to make him kind of look from like a demon race. Let's look at these. Okay, so these are like scars. These those are tattoos. Let's see what we can do with scars. Ooh, I like that. Let's see that. Let's see. I think adding a tattoo might be too much. Possibly. Ooh, that's nice. I'll do that. It might try to do a different scar though then. Ah. Alright, let's next go to his, his brow. Alright, let's change up his eyes. Do you like that? Ooh, that's nice too. Let's make it like that purplish color. A bit darker. We got darker purple. Pink side. There we go. We're gonna... Let's see, what does death do? Oh, this makes his eyes look like he's popping out or. Let's go with sunken eyes. You know, he's seen some shit type thing. I won't spend too much more time. Oh, we need a player name. Let's give it. Let's make it. Sounds like an older name. Alright, finalize. Let the game King begin. King Alant the Twelfth, by channeling the power of souls, brought unprecedented prosperity to his northern kingdom of Boletaria. That is, until the colorless deep fog swept across the land. cut off from the outside world and those who dared penetrate the deep fog never returned but valifax of the royal twin fangs broke free from the fog and told the world of boletaria's plight that the old king alant had roused the old one the great beast below the nexus from its eternal slumber, and that a colorless fog had swept in, unleashing terrible demons. The demons hunt down men and claim their souls. Those who lose their souls lose also their minds. The mad attack the sane and chaos reigns. Valifax also spoke of the enticing power of the demon souls. Each time a demon claims a human soul, the demon's own soul is invigorated by the life force. And the power of a mature demon soul is beyond human imagination. The legend spread quickly, 
Mighty warriors lured by the possibilities braved the fisher to breach the accursed land. But none have returned. Pure of the Twin Fangs. Yet the silent chief. Saint Urbain. Skurva the Wanderer. The sixth Saint Astria with her knight Gaal Vinland. And Sage Frake the Visionary. The colorless deep fog slowly creeps beyond Boletaria's borders. Humankind faces a slow and steady extinction. Nice. The deep fog will eventually swallow all lands near and far. But Boletaria has one final hope. A lone warrior who has braved the baneful fog. Oh, has the land found its savior? Or have the demons found a new slave? Oh. Is that me? Skip it. Brave soul who fears not. I'm looking sick. Sexy, bro. I shall guide you to the fisher. Who are you? That's so a... that you may lull nice. the old one back to slumber. See what's going on. Right, what is this? R1 standard attack. Okay. So, ah, see. Nice. That was easy. That was. Uh, I think that's probably then my heavy attack. Let's see what's this say. Hold L and O to sprint. Oh, okay, that's nice. So no. What's this? R L1 is guard, so alright. Oh, that one hits it away, okay. That's my L2. Get shit out of you. He dies pretty fast. And read this message. R3 to lock on target. Okay, so basically. Oh, that's nice. Alright. All pretty easy so far. Just go check on the room. I don't see no loot. Something you guys probably know that I am definitely a loot. I love loot. It's amazing. Here. Actually, let's see what we have in my inventory. What's this? By a wand. You're supposed to put it in this hand. Okay, so that changes that. Alright. What does Crescent Moongrass do? We'll find out soon. Alright. Okay, that's just how the bolt. That's just a roll. Right, just come over here. I pulled. What does this do? Well, that's nice. Range attack, go. Walking in, look around. I totally fucked that one up. Get stabbed. Running over here. Let's make sure. Oh, shit. oh, that's a one shot. That's nice. Run over here. Grab remake that shit. 
Alright, well, I think we have to touch this. Looks important. Alright. Strong attack ideas, so I found out already. Turn around. Let's break some shit. Oh, shit. Oh, I just kicked his ass. Got hurt a little bit, but should be okay. L2. Okay, that's this. Uh, after parrying. Okay, that's when you're supposed to so you parry and stab. Let's try it out. Alright. Block on target. Roll. He's stabbed here. I'm gonna go back to my wand. That guy looks like he was supposed to be tough. That's why I like magic. Oh, so it gives me a bit more of a power attack. What the fuck are you doing, bro? Why? Why? Got him. Easy. Easy. Okay, that makes sense. Okay. See what are you gonna give me? Some more of that moon grass. That one's different color. It's slightly red on the outside. Got oh well, he is lightly armored. I got an undone soul. Some more of that moon grass, or the hell that is. Alright. Do uh where do I go? Oh it's right over here. Right. Uh, doesn't look like there's anything too crazy in here. Just quickly stab, stab. Yeah, screw you. And the corpse. Alright, let's go hop in here. Alright, two directions. I don't know if I'm like dealing with you right now, sir. Let's see what's down here. Ah, oh, coral corpse. Alright, run this way now. Well, I'll just mess that up. Alright, let's find out what's in here. What the hell? This is supposed to be like the like, tutorial. I oh damn, he just one shot me. Why do they expect me to be have to kill this shit on level one? He looks like a badass, so he does for sure. Ooh, what's this place? The soul of the lost withdrawn from its vessel. Let strength be granted so the world might be mended. Soul of the lost withdrawn from its vessel. Let strength be granted so the world might be mended. So the world might be mended. Well, this seems like a good place to stop for the first episode, or the first part of my Demon Souls adventure. Alright, hope everyone is having a great day. This is Solus, I'm out.